Talking Beard Knives with Ahmed and Atif. They're gonna go over some of their line of knives. Uh, you guys have seen their product in quite a few videos, such as the Karambit here, and some of their fixed blades that I own. So I'll let it over to these guys, and they'll tell you what's up. Hey, how's it going, man? Ahmed from B&B Knives. We got some new knives, man. We got some new designs. We got the uh, snake wood with the uh, Damascus blade. We got the uh, cleavers, the new cleavers that just came out. If you want to check out the new cleaver, you know what I'm saying? Right there. You know? We got another colorway as well. The khaki, the khaki cleaver. And we got the high carbonated steel one right here. That's the diesel one, right? Yes, sir, the diesel one. You know? And, uh, yeah, man, we got a lot of different. Uh, we got the uh, Cobra with the uh, shark teeth right here. You know, nice there. grip, yeah. Good, good jumping on the back of the yep, blade. Full there. tank construction, D2 steel. Uh, do you guys use D2 for the majority of the blades? Or? Yeah, most of our blades are all D2. Uh, this is the Batman blade, D2 as well. Batman blade also D2 as well. How's the, how's the D2 hold up as far as rust and corrosion? Um, it, it's, it's pretty good uh, as long as you keep it uh, oiled, uh, good vegetation oil. You use cooking oil, you can use uh, various different things. Uh, we have a specialist over here, you can actually uh, yeah. try to elaborate. Yeah, definitely. So uh, a lot of our D2 blades, they have a titanium coating on them, preventing from rusting, chipping, and scratches. Uh, is that like a Cerakoting? Or that's is that a titanium like coating. It's like an acid coating. Titanium. Yep. And then, uh, then we have our tactical Cobra. That has a Cerakote finish. So can you go over some of the new Karambits? I see you got the, uh, yeah, uh, the Dragon the Karambit, Karambit there. Karambit. Yeah, so we have uh, there are new Karambits here. So that's what I carry. I've been carrying that for the past year. I've done quite a few videos on them in the past. Uh, awesome knife, holds up really well. Quick deployment, no hesitation in, in operation on it. They come in three different uh, three different colors. Yeah, I think last year when I was here, you guys only had the OD and the black, so the yeah. red is the new the color. The red is the new color in that, yes. Awesome. We also have our classic Bushcraft Damascus Tracker, G10 grip, Damascus blade. It's beautiful. Do you know what for mixture of metals are in? Oh uh, yeah, so in our Damascus, yes sir. In the Damascus, sir, we use 1095 high carbon steel, um, uh, 15 and 20, with a 58 to 60 HRC. So it's a great blade, holds a great edge, easier to sharpen, easy to work with. So it's a great knife. Uh, we also have, uh, this is our new one, it's called the Abalone Flipper. Opens up really nice, it has abalone shell, pocket clip, it also comes with a leather sheath right here. So I just bought the snake wood flipper here. Yeah. All of their Damascus is absolutely beautiful. Thank uh, you. You guys mix it really well and, and just get an awesome look to it. Appreciate so. it, thank you so much. I will, uh, I'll put the links for everything in the description below and I, I really appreciate you guys yes, sir. doing appreciate the video you. for us. You're welcome, so. pleasure, thanks for stopping by. Yeah, no problem. And actually doing this for us, I really appreciate that. Thank no you. No problem, guys.